What's up everyone? Thank you for watching my YouTube channel. Like, subscribe, and comment below. Anywho, I have really exciting announcement. I am doing a Bruce Willis film called Cosmic Sin. It is a sci-fi thriller where I play the baddest assassin in the galaxy. Reading yellow in. Very excited. Yeah. The character we're creating. It's awesome. Yellow was the right move. She braided all this in. Yes. I am fighting for humankind. I am the best warrior, the best sniper, the best assassin, and I'm fighting for humans to survive in the galaxy against aliens. If you love sci-fi, I personally love sci-fi. I think it's amazing. Star Wars is one of my favorite movies. My character is like Han Solo meets Princess Leia, who I love them both. So freaking amazing. Let me show you guys this. Ah! Absolutely love my costume. Um, I just feel like I'm in the galaxy, ready to fight. I am so grateful and so thankful um, to Corey Larg and also to Bruce Willis for casting me in this movie. Thank you guys so much. Originally, this role, um, Soul, was written for a guy, but the amazing actress that I am, um, the phenomenal actress that I am, they casted me as Soul and changed the male role into a female role. So I just wanna give a big shout out to my haters and naysayers, all those freaking fans, all those people on Twitter that wanted to go out and talk about how my acting was so bad when I came out and gave the most amazing promos that the WWE Universe has literally ever seen. You guys are so ungrateful. It's literally disgusting. Like, do you not understand who I am? I am the greatest, greatest WWE superstar who has ever acted in history. I just want you guys to start naming some people that are WWE superstars that are as good of an actress as me. I just, I'm waiting. Ding, 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 ding. Oh wait, because there is none. I am the Ravishing Russian Lana on Monday Night Raw on the USA Network, literally the best villain that there has ever been. I should be winning every single award on television. I should be winning Emmys, Golden Globes, definitely MTV Awards, Team Choice Awards, People's Choice Awards, Kids Choice Awards, because there's no better villain than the Ravishing Russia Lana. Literally no one. And instead of going out and being like, wow, your acting is phenomenal. It's just all this complaining. And I just want you guys to know, it just made me work harder and harder and harder because I am the best actress that WWE has ever seen. That that's how good I am. That that is how good of a villain that I am. That I provoke such loud reactions that you guys don't even realize that when you guys are tweeting all your hate, it's actually specifically planned by me and you are hooking onto my bait just like I throw out my fish and freaking hook that fish into the river. You know what, I really do have a chip over my shoulder with all my haters and naysayers. And guess who's laughing? Guess who is laughing now? <laughs> Me! Me! L A N A. Lana, 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 Lana. Lana, Lana. I can't wait for you guys to watch this movie. I'm also thankful for the WWE Universe and the fan base and my fan base who does support me. You know, the people that have stood by my side and followed my journey from the very, very beginning. I can't even start to tell you how much that means to me. And I just really, really want to say thank you guys because you guys are amazing and I love you. What it do? So here I am, day one. Day one on set of the Bruce Willis movie, Cosmic Sin. Super excited. I'm in Atlanta, Georgia. I haven't slept much, to be honest. I, in a week, I've gone from LA to Winnipeg, 
to Saudi Arabia, to Germany, to Boston, to LAX, to Atlanta. So I was home for like about 20 hours. Um, after 30 hours of um, traveling, Delta lost my bag uh, with Boston um, Airport again. We just did that like two months ago, so shout out. So flew in a red eye last night. I slept two hours. I start filming with Bruce Willis in a couple of hours, if that. Super excited, also like really nervous and because I don't want to fail, I don't want to do a bad job, but also really exciting and okay, here we go. All right, so we are here. We went for a certain point and then we to hold out here. So I have just wrapped my second day and it was my first day with Bruce Willis and he was awesome and working with him was so incredible. I'm so blown away like watching him like how he takes his time and has it all his thoughts and like you know builds the drama and suspense because he just takes his time and like lives in the moment and you know it's just so 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 good I was so impressed and I'm like oh that's the reason why you're a movie star that's why you make all this money because you're freaking good just it was great because you know it's like not editing you actually see it you're like whoa that wasn't like post or anything like that so that was really 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 cool i felt like i learned a lot today i feel like wrestling and acting have a lot of like correlations um when you watch like randy orton john cena they all take their time like in between things like like the drama like they let it they they let the crowd react. They let you wonder what's gonna be next, what's gonna happen. It's like drama, drama, drama. Because if you move, 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 you don't let like the viewer, the audience, the people watching, like let it settle in, like let it set and let people like digest what just happened. And then uh, let us as the viewer imagine, well, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? And like, then maybe be cheering for one side or the other. Like, no, 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 like kiss, 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 or don't kiss, or don't go into that room. Um, um, and it's the same with acting when you see like when I saw Bruce and his pacing I was like whoa that's so crazy like he takes his time so it was like really cool to see those like correlations and I, I feel very blessed and honored to be able to work have worked with people like John Cena and um, The Rock, Randy Orton so many greats and um, I've learned so much from them and I feel like it's really really cool for me to be out here with some of the best actors as well learning from them and um it's cool I'm extremely grateful extremely extremely grateful and I hope that one day I'll be able to be a Marvel a Marvel TV show or um movie the thing that I want to share with all you guys is that don't listen to the people that don't believe in you chase your dreams chase the things that you love passionately never take no for an answer build a tunnel underneath a walkway around a bridge over maybe you just kick down the door but never take a no for an answer if the door shuts then turn and find another door that's even freaking better and then wave to the other door and say thank you believe in yourself and chase those dreams <laughs>